Submissions 101, I'm going to demonstrate how to do the floating Americana arm lock from the scarf hold position. So I'm going to have Matt down on the ground here. I have my scarf position. Now often what will happen is this arm will become loose and start floating up. And what people will do is they'll grab onto it with one hand and then they'll take their other hand and grab onto their wrist. They're basically going for that Americana. But the problem is, is you don't have enough leverage to finish it because your arm is underneath his head. So what we're going to do is we're just going to release and change hands. So if you watch, my left hand is now going to grab onto his wrist. My right hand is going to cup onto his head. I'm going to pull his head this way and push his arm and hand at a 45 degree angle up towards the ceiling to get the arm on. Now this transfer has to be quick. It's here, I grab, and I pull. The reason you're pulling the head, it's not a crank. Everyone will ask in the video if it's a crank. It's an arm lock. The reason I'm doing that is because it creates more pressure on his arm when I pull his body away from it. Rather than just trying to push here, as you can see, I'm not getting anything. Now as I start pulling, you'll get it. So we'll just change this angle. So here's my position. I decide to change one, two, Three. Notice how I'm sliding my body down and pushing weight at the same time. When I transfer my hands, I cup. I actually have a monkey, monkey grip, so my thumb is on top. It's not gripping his hand, it's here. So I'm making my thumb disappear and just grabbing on head, and then you've got the floating Americana.